hello guys today we are going to be unboxing the giant dinosaur egg it has 12 plus 1 unique dinosaur to dig 12 plus 1 hmm, interesting and what do we have here it says it's going to be having 12 different dinosaurs 12 learning cards 6 digging tools and a board game and dig like a real pentologist so here we are so i think so it's time that we unbox this thing please don't forget to subscribe for this channel and press the bell button so that we can keep bringing you these videos so let's start the unboxing process start the tape let's see what we get oh okay here we get some items let's keep it on the side Here's our egg, a giant egg, and we have a board game. So let's do one thing, let's keep this board game at the top and we'll come back. So here we are, you can see behind there is poster for the board game, looks good, but we are after the egg. So this is the beautiful egg, so what tools do we get? We get a hammer, a bigger hammer, we got cleaning and digging tool two dice as well as some more digging tools and we have our dinosaur cards so without any further ado let's start let's see what we do get here let's open the egg now we are going to start the process let's see how easy or difficult it is going to dig this thing up let's see so let's let's take out some tool we are going to be using these two tools and a hammer so let's start let's see how difficult it is let's do it this way oh it's coming out there are supposed to be 12 dinosaurs in this we still don't see any dinosaur coming out yet something is starting to come out I think so we are on to our first dinosaur with the hammer come on come on I can see the tail I can see the tail coming out ah, but his head is stuck here so we have to dig from this side can it come out now yes 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 we have our first dinosaur coming out let's keep digging at the end we are going to Look at all the dinosaurs. Oh, I see one more coming out. One more, one more. I see the orange. So let's dig it from here. Oh, one big thing. And we have our second dinosaur. Wow, this guy looks good as well. Let's keep it on the side. And we will review and we'll name all the dinosaurs after we dig it it's a huge egg guys it's a huge egg i can see one more but this little guy is stuck so we have to I, this is the way we will do it there are two of them there are two of them guys there are two of them keep going keep going here it is our third dinosaur nice keep it on the side I can see something is here as well oh nice let's pull it out pull it out pull it out yes this is our fourth dinosaur nice who do we have next I can see the tail of this little guy oops yes the digging is going good i am becoming a professional in this now yes this one is almost out more digging to make it easy for our dinosaur to come out can it come out now still not coming out yes so here we have our fifth dinosaur looking nice 
I can see a green one here. So let's let's dig from this side. Guys, see. You can see it's coming out. We have a green dinosaur on our hands. Oh yes, yo yes. Oh, still his head is stuck. It's not easy, guys. Oh yes, here he goes. Ooh, very nice. Excellent. We are going to be naming and showing you the learning card for all of them once we clean them up. So, what's next? Next is only one thing. Keep digging. Come on, come on, little guy. We are going to take you out. Almost there. I think so. This is the one which belongs to the ocean. Oh, wow. This is a new one. I have not seen this one at all before. Looks nice. Seven dinosaurs are out. Still, we have five to go. I can see. I can see. Can you guys see? We found one more. Take this little guy out. Oh, yes. Here we are. Here we are. This is our eighth dinosaur. Looking nice. Come on, little dinos. Where are you hiding? We have four to go. I think so. Yes. I think so. Here we are. The, can you guys see this one? Okay. Let's take from this. This is. We are close. We are close. We are very close to finding our ninth dinosaur. Let's break it from here. Big hammer. Big hammer. We are very close. We are very close. Here we are. Ooh, we have a big giant one. We have three more to go. And where are we going to find those three? We have to dig more. Looks like we have to dig the entire egg in order to get it through. No problem. We will do it together. <gasps> there is, in fact, I found two. Two of them. Oh, wow. Nice. Then are done. Two more to go. Here we are. You guys can see. We have found one more. The eleventh one. Come on, little guy. Oh yes. Here we are. Oh, wow. These are amazing dinosaurs, guys. I think so. We're getting excellent dinosaurs. I cannot break it. I'm a Hercules. Ah no, I don't have the. The power is not with me today. So the plan is working, guys. We're going to split the egg into two. Let's see if we can. Yes. Wow. That was a good fly. Here, you guys can see. Here is our 12th dinosaur. Looking nice. But now we are done with 12. But what I want to see on the box, it said. 12 plus 1. So is it that there is one more dinosaur hiding inside this egg? There is only one way to find out. We need to break the entire egg and see if there is something because it said 12 plus 1. Dig, dig and dig. It broke. It broke. It broke. It broke. Now oh, it's breaking, guys. But I don't find any new dinosaur. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 12. Oh, maybe it meant that it was 12 plus 1 was the board game. Is it? Let's break this as well. So this is it, guys. I think we had only 12 dinosaurs. Let me clean everything up and come back and then we see the dinosaurs with their learning cards. So here we are guys with all our beautiful colorful dinosaurs all washed up. So let's begin. 
So which one is the first one which we have? We have this little guy. And who is this little guy? It is Corythosaurus. Like Parasaurolophus, this dinosaur was duck-billed and used the crest on its head to create a low noise. Scientists think it may have sounded like a trombone. Nice. So let's keep it on this side. And we're done with one. Let's let's have the second one. Second one we have is Stegosaurus. Stegosaurus. This peaceful dinosaur had spike on its tail that probably helped protect it from other animals. The plates on its back might have helped the dinosaur keep warm or cool. This one is looking cool as well. Very nice. So we have done with our second one, which is our third one. We have the one and only, the big and the giant, Tyrannosaurus rex, also known as the T-Rex. This dinosaur was one of the most furious predators ever. Its huge mouth had giant sharp teeth that measured 6 to 12 inches long. Wow, that was amazing. A very giant and dangerous dinosaur. So who do we have next? We have Triceratops. Triceratops means three horned face and it's easy to see how this dinosaur got its name. Triceratops used its bony beak and 800 small teeth to eat low plants. 800 small teeth. Those are a lot of teeth, guys. Wow. Excellent. Beautiful. So who do we have next? We have the one and only Spinosaurus. Looking good. So this is one of the only dinosaurs that could swim in water when swimming it breathed through holes high up on its nose and paddled with its webbed feet. Wow, looking nice. So who do we have next? We have Oranosaurus. Oranosaurus looking nice. Like Spinosaurus, this dinosaur had a huge sail on its back. Scientists believe the 8,000 pound animal used the sail to protect itself from overheating in warm climates. Nice. So who do we have next? We have this little guy. Beautiful. Stegosaurus. This dinosaur weighed around 100 pounds and was only 3 feet tall about the same size as a dog. Scientists aren't shown why Stegosaurus had a thick domed skull. It may have used it for fighting. Nice. I've seen this one in Jurassic movie and they were awesome, cute, but very dangerous. So who do we have next? We have this little guy and which, which dinosaur is this? It is Parasaur all of us. This dinosaur had an oddly shaped head and a duck bill the long crest on his head made a sound this sound might have been how these dinosaurs talk to one another nice looking excellent and beautiful so who do we have this cute little dinosaur mostly used to be in water it is plesiosaur so plesiosaur the giant marine reptile used its flippers and tail to swim the seas during the age of the dinosaurs. Its long neck let it sneak up on other animals and take a bite without having to get too close. Plus the plesiosaur used its long thin teeth to trap fish. Excellent. Beautiful. Who do we have next? We have this guy. And this is Apatosaurus. This dinosaur was one of the largest land animals that ever lived. An adult Apatosaurus could weigh up to 45 tons. That's as much as 5 adult elephants. Wow, he would have been huge. Who do we have next? We have this beautiful dinosaur and who this is it is ankylosaurus 
This dinosaur was covered in thick bony plates that helped keep it safe from other dinosaurs even though it was super tough. Ankylosaurus ate only plants. Nice. And the last dinosaur which we have is Giganotosaurus. Giganotosaurus means giant southern lizard. This gigantic predator was taller and longer than T-Rex. An adult Giganotosaurus could run up to 30 miles per hour. Scientists believe it may have hunted for prey in small packs. So there we are guys. This is the end of the video. If you like the video, please don't forget to subscribe for this channel and press the like button. It will really support us and we will keep bringing you videos like this. Thank you very much guys.